in my last video I talked a little bit about how you can change the audio settings, the default audio settings in Zoom to make it a little bit better sounding for doing music performance and music teaching. Um, I realize that not everybody has access to a computer um, and they're doing everything off of an iPhone or an iPad. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how you can do some of the things on an iPhone. You don't get all of the options but you can you can do some things. So let's go ahead and open Zoom. I'm running on iPhone 11 by the way. Um, and this is my meet and chat. If you go down to the bottom here you see the settings wheel. And we'll push that settings wheel down there. Okay. And let's go push the meetings button. Okay. So let's see. About half to three quarters of the way down you can see this uh, use original sound here. We want to turn that on. Okay. Now I don't see anything here for doing background noise but honestly I think that the original sound does as much or more than anything. Okay. So let's go ahead. Let's go back out of here. And the same type of deal applies with an iPhone which means that you can go into a meeting. So I'm going to start a meeting here. And then we'll say call using internet. Okay. But I can go in and get these settings here. So if we go under more, we can actually choose to enable original sound or disable original sound. So we always want to have it enabled if you're trying to play or, or trying to uh, teach. So I hope that that was helpful. If you have any more tips or anything like that, send me something in the comments and um, and I'll add some more to this video.